Hi, it's me again, guys. Okay, so today we're going to read Thomas Helps Out. Good morning, Thomas, said Sir Topham Pat. We need your help today. Thomas peeped happily. Beep, beep. Gordon is stuck on the track and the harvest must be brought to town today. Do you think you can help? You can count on me, said Thomas, as he charged out of the shed, or chugged. As Thomas approached the farm, he saw Gordon halted on the track. A cow was blocking his way. Thomas tried to help the farmer coax the cow off the tracks, but she wouldn't budge. Don't worry, Gordon, Thomas called. I'll make sure the harvest gets to town today. Thank you, Thomas, said Gordon with relief. When Thomas reached the farm, the sky was gray and cloudy. We better hurry if we want to load the crops before it starts to rain, one of the farmhands called to the others. The men worked quickly, but soon the rain began to fall. As they worked, Thomas worried. He hoped his brakes would work in the rain. He was not used to carrying such a heavy load all by himself. When all the crates had been loaded, Thomas set off carefully with the harvest. When he came to the railroad crossing, he braked slowly so he wouldn't skid on the wet tracks. Well done, Thomas, called his driver. You're doing fine. By the time Thomas reached town, the rain had cleared and the sun was shining brightly again in the sky. Thomas, called Sir Topham Hat from the platform in town, you are a really useful engine. You brought in the harvest all by yourself. Thank you for your hard work. Thomas let off a big puff of steam and smiled. Ready? He's a really useful engine, you know. Cause the fat controller, he told him so. Now he's got a branch line to call his very own. He's the really useful engine we adore. He's the one. He's the one, he's the really useful engine that we adore. He's the one, he's the number one, Thomas the Tank Engine. 